Okay, so good day everybody. This is our quiz for the introduction to accounting. So this is a 15 item quiz. So please get your one four sheet of uh, paper, then write one to 15, and uh, we will have our 15 item quiz. So let's uh, write true if the statement is true and false if it is incorrect. Okay, so in each of the items, you are given 5 seconds to answer after I read the statement. But syempre, you can pause the video if you need some more time understanding the statement. Okay, and then we will be answering them at the end of this video. So before anything else, may I please again remind you, please, to like and subscribe to Sir Chuba's Accounting Lessons PH. Okay? So, again, each item has 5 seconds, but you can pause the video if you need some more time to think about the answer. Okay? Let's start. Okay? True or false? Number 1. Accounting is a service activity primarily concerned with qualitative financial information. Accounting is a service activity primarily concerned with qualitative financial information. Next number, number two. Financial accounting information is primarily used by external users of accounting information. Financial accounting information is primarily used by external users of accounting information. Number three. Bookkeeping is the routine recording of economic activities and is a mechanical process. Bookkeeping is the routine recording of economic activities and is a mechanical process. Number four, tax accounting is mainly concerned with the verification of financial reports. Tax accounting is mainly concerned with the verification of financial reports. Number five, GAAP means generally accepted accounting policies. GAAP means Generally Accepted Accounting Policies Number 6 When pooling of assets and other resources is involved, an entity is more likely a partnership firm. When pooling of, re of assets and other resources is involved, an entity is more likely a partnership firm. Number seven, an entity concerned with processing raw materials to become finished goods is a merchandising entity. An entity concerned with processing raw materials to become finished goods is a merchandising entity. Number eight. The going concern principle stands on the concept that financial reports should be prepared on the assumption that the entity will continue in operations indefinitely. The going concern principle stands on the concept that financial reports should be prepared on the assumption that the entity will continue in operations indefinitely. Number 9. Financial information is faithfully represented if it is complete, neutral, and free from error. Financial information is faithfully represented if it is complete, neutral, and free from error. Number 10. The enhancing characteristics of useful financial information includes Comparability, verifiability, timeliness, and relevance. 
The enhancing characteristics of useful financial information includes comparability, verifiability, timeliness, and relevance. Number 11. Assets are the things of value owned by the entity which expects to bring future economic benefits. Assets are the things of value owned by the entity which expects to bring future economic benefits. Number 12. Liabilities are obligations which will result to outflow of economic benefits when settled. Liabilities are obligations which will result to outflow of economic benefits when settled. Number 13. The Statement of Comprehensive Income includes information about the entity's revenues and expenses. The Statement of Comprehensive Income includes information about the entity's revenues and expenses. Number 14. Practice of accountancy in commerce and industry includes accounting supervisors working for private entities. Practice of accountancy in commerce and industry includes accounting supervisors working for private entities. Last number, number 15. Teaching accounting in a state university is a practice of accountancy in the government. Teaching accounting in a state university is a practice of accountancy in the government. And we're done. So you can go back to the earlier parts of the video if you have some items that you need to, to revisit. And uh, at this point in time, we will be discussing the answers for each item. So, dapat maka, ano man lang sana kayo ha, 10 over 15. Wag nating ikalahating 8 over 15, okay? Dapat 10 over 15 or 12 over 15. Okay, number one. Accounting is a service activity primarily concerned with qualitative financial information. This is false. Because accounting is a service activity primarily concerned with quantitative financial information. So number one is false. Number two, financial accounting information is primarily used by external users of accounting information. This is true. Just remember this uh, word partners. Financial accounting, external Management accounting, internal. So, number two is true. Number three, bookkeeping is the routine recording of economic activities and is a mechanical process. This is the definition of bookkeeping. This is true. Number four, tax accounting is mainly concerned with the verification of financial reports. This is false because it is auditing which is mainly concerned with the verification of financial reports. And tax accounting is more on the computation and compliance of taxes. And also tax reporting. So number four is false. So the right word here in the subject of the sentence is auditing, which is mainly concerned with the verification of financial reports. Number five, GAAP means generally accepted accounting policies. This is false because GAAP means Generally accepted accounting principles. Number six, when pooling of assets and other resources is involved, an entity is more likely a partnership firm. Remember that a partnership is a contract between two or more persons who bind themselves to contribute money, property, or industry into a common fund and their intention is to divide profits between themselves. So number six is true. Number seven, an entity concerned with processing raw materials to become finished goods is a merchandising entity. This is false. Because the entity concerned with processing raw materials to become finished goods is a manufacturing entity. So number seven is false. 
Number eight, the going concern principle stands on the concept that financial reports should be prepared on the assumption that the entity will continue in operations indefinitely, hindi magsasara. So number eight is true. Number nine, financial information is faithfully represented if it is complete, neutral, and free from error. These are the three components of faithful representation, complete, neutral, and free from error. Number nine is true. Number 10, the enhancing characteristics of useful financial information includes comparability, verifiability, timeliness, and relevance. This is false. Relevance is a fundamental qualitative characteristic. The four enhancing qualitative characteristics of useful financial information is comparability, verifiability, timeliness, and understandability. So number 10 is false. 11. Assets are things of value owned by the entity which expects to bring future economic benefits. This is true. Number 12. Liabilities are obligations which will result to outflow of economic benefits when settled. This is also true. Number 13. The statement of comprehensive income includes information about the entity's revenues and expenses. This is true. Number 14. The practice of accountancy in commerce and industry includes accounting supervisors working for private entities. This is true. And number 15, teaching accounting in a state university is a practice of accountancy in the government. Teaching accounting is the function and we need to look on the function, not on where he or she is really doing that job. So even though you are in a state university which is being run by the government, teaching accounting is a practice of accountancy in the academe or in education. So number 15 is false. So you can go back to the earlier parts of the video for you to review these concepts. So this has been the, our introduction to accounting. And uh, thank you very much. So in our next video, we will now start dealing with numbers, primarily with the accounting equation. Please like and subscribe. Search to us, Accounting Lessons PH. Thank you very much and uh, see you in our next video.